part 6 from my stream let's play of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Last time, we headed through Rock Pass to level up a bit, then took on Mount Blaze again where we finally reached and defeated Moltres. After that, we headed through the Frosted Forest where we ended up meeting and defeating Articuno. Once we had, Absol showed us, showed up, excuse me, to save us from being taken out when Articuno didn't quite believe we were being honest about what was going on. Absol, of course, standing up for us and telling that we weren't lying. Following that, we headed into Mount Freeze, getting about halfway through it before we stopped. We are going to be picking things up from there and seeing where things go. So, let's get right back into things, shall we? Let's play! Alrighty! So, let's see here. Let's see, what I'm, let's see what I'm actually holding on to at the current moment. Uh, da, da, da. Okay, yeah, I'm good. I'm good for the time being. Alright. So, that being said... Let's go ahead and get some stuff going on, shall we? Nice that. Here we go. Yes. Now, freeze peak. Alrighty. Now. Oh, and did you find me an Ornberry? Nice. Very good.
nice. Very nice. Finally made it. This is the peak, right? Where could Nine Tails be? There they are. I spotted Charlie. All right, I see them. Alexam. It's about time we finally caught up with you. You fugitive act dragged us all the way out here. Pipe down, Tyranitar. We can finally settle things here. I can barely contain myself, I'm itching for a fight. Meiji, don't think badly of me. I don't know how to show mercy. Charlie, I didn't wish for this conclusion. That's absolutely fine, Meiji. Glad to have you. Aloha. But this too is fate. The role of rescue team is to help bring peace. We'll crush you with every shred of our power. Get them. Nine tails. What? Nine tails? Th that's nine tails? The legend. It was real. Cease fighting at once, Alexam. They are my guests. Tell us, nine tails. Who is the human that appeared in your legend? No, even before that, was the legend itself a true event? Depending on your reply, I may have no choice but to eliminate them. Whether they consider my curse to be a legend or not, I care not. However, it did happen. Many years ago, I tried to lay a curse on a human. It was then, however, that Gardevoir, the human's partner, dashed in. It selflessly bore a full brunt of the curse meant for the human. Then, the human did a selfish and cowardly thing. They abandoned Gardevoir and fre fled. The human eventually became a Pokemon. Transformed into a Pokemon, the human. The human lives on. And that human would be? Who is the human that you speak of? Charlie, you may relax. It is not you. Mm hmm? Just now? What did you just say? Charlie is not the human that appears in the legend. That is what I said. What? What? Hmm. What's wrong with me? I'm too tensed up to move. O oof. 
Oof. Deep breaths. In, out. In, out. In, out. Phew. Oh, wow. Awesome. Wow. Wow. That's great. I knew Charlie wasn't the one. It's just as I thought. Charlie wouldn't do anything like that. I have another thing to say. It is true that I foretold the world's balance become unstable. However, if you become a Pokemon and the world balance, they are not linked in any way. Causes of natural calamities they exist elsewhere. Hey, you lot! You were wrong. You doubted and hounded Charlie. Apologize. We're sorry. We got so worked up by that Gengar. No. I suspect that Gengar was right from the start. Charlie just doesn't look like the treacherous type. Haha. <laughs> no, it'd be nice if I could believe that. But I must say, you are to be commended for prevailing through the cruel journey and discovering the truth. Impressive, Charlie. <laughs> Isn't that great? I was convinced I was right. Huh? But wait a second. Why did Charlie become a Pokemon? I understand that Charlie isn't the human that appeared in the legend. But then why would Charlie become a Pokemon? Charlie, who are you? Wow, well, the ground's heaving. Quick quake. The world's crust is shifting. Natural calamities are worsening. team made their way to the underground to quell the awakened Groudon. Meanwhile, cleared of all suspicion, Charlie's team put an end to their long and arduous journey and returned to their welcoming rescue team base. Charlie safely finished an adventure in Mount Freeze Peak. And they received have been sent to the storage. Hooray. Ah, uh, aloha, David. Good to see ya. That's okay, I haven't been going too long. Only about 15 minutes so far, so you're fine. Meanwhile, back in Pokemon Square. <laughs> you lot. Why aren't you out there hurting Charlie's team? Hunting Charlie's team? That's easy for you to say. It's too much for us. They say Charlie's team has gone way far out there. If we went, we'd be best we could hope for is maybe Lapis Cave. I joined the chase, but they fled into Mount Blaze. For the life of me, I can't go in there. That's where I lost their trail. I'm a grass type, you see. Fire doesn't agree with me at all. I don't know what became of Charlie's team after that. But those fugitives, I think they wouldn't... To think they would risk Mount Blaze. They've grown up a little bit tough. I can't keep up. Haha. <laughs> What a spineless lot you are. Ch You're so full of big talk. What about your team, Gengar? You just hang around the square and don't do a thing. You got you walk the talk. You guys go. We're out of that picture. <laughs> Our role is to receive worry about Charlie's demise. <laughs> you disappointed yourself that. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Medicham, what's the word? 
Charlie, Charlie is... Finally, we're rid of Charlie. <laughs> no, it's the opposite. Charlie is back. <laughs> what did you say? Hey, over there. Charlie, they're back. Hi, everyone. We're back. <laughs> we finally made it back. We've been gone for so long. Is that what I think it is? Yep, this is the Pokemon Square. It's good to be back in the square again, Charlie. Hey, Meiji. Uh, it's you, Gengar. It's been a while. <laughs> What's that smooth confidence? I don't recognize that weirdo in the back, either. Could it be? Gengar! You spot spewed all sorts of trumped-up garbage, didn't you? Charlie had nothing to do with it. Charlie was innocent. <laughs> what? Is that true? You bet. We met Ninetales and found out. Charlie isn't the human from that legend. Team back when we found that out. <laughs> well, wait a second. You can't be trusted yet. If you're gonna make that claim, let's see some proof. Proof? That's right, some hard evidence. <laughs> let's see some proof. Come on out with it. Proof. We don't have any proof. <laughs> it's too bad you don't have any proof. Came back to us so we could get rid of you easier. How conveniently foolish. <laughs> now, fellow Pokemon, here's your chance to get rid of Charlie. <laughs> hmm? Okay. What's wrong, everyone? Don't you want to be rid of Charlie? I... I always believed in Charlie. You don't fool me. A good? I... I'm out. I was looking for Charlie's team once before. I joined the chase with a heavy heart because of your urging. But I simply can't think of Charlie as being bad in any way. Exactly, David. Exactly. Where's his proof? <laughs> I've heard enough too. I believe Charlie. Yeah, that's right. Who needs proof? <laughs> Everyone. Extra, extra, read all about it. I'll read it aloud. Let's see. Pokemon News. Extra. Charlie Innocent. Charlie met with the Nine Tails under the watchful eye of Alakazam. And proved that they had nothing to do with the human in the legend. As a result, Gengar's claims were found to be malicious lies. End. <laughs> you rotten... <laughs> Run! That would have been funny, David. That would have been hilarious. Stop, you liar, you conned us! Welcome back. Yep, it's good to be back. We're back like we promised. I'm so glad. And Charlie isn't suspect suspected anymore. Yep, I'm glad too. We won't have to keep running away from everyone anymore. Alright, Charlie. We're both worn out. It's time to get some sleep. The rescue team's back in business. Tomorrow, let's give it our best. The next morning... Good morning, Charlie. Get a good night's nice sleep? Okay, we're back in the rescue team business. Plunk. Pelipper's brought us mail already, too. Let's 
give it our best like we always used to, Charlie. Letter from Pelipper. Yo, amigo, it's awesome you're back. I will deliver mail to you again. I've been looking forward to this with my bill outstretched. I deliver tons of mail, so you better be ready, amigo. Wandering postal character Pelipper. Carrier Pelipper. Wonder Tiles. Wonder Tiles reset attack and defense. If your attack is lower by foe's crowd, for example, if attack attack can be returned to normal by stepping on a Wonder Tile. We'll be going to the next floor. Beware though, enhanced stats are also reset to normal. And we got an out steel quest. Okay. So let's see, what kind of quest do we kind of have though? Three for Mount Steel. We have one, two, three for Sinister Woods. Two for Silent Chasm. And two for Mount, uh, Mount Thunder. Alright, well, let's go get some of these done, hmm? Let's get some work done. And of course, every single one of them has an extra bad guy to it. An extra strong bad guy to it. Of course they do. Dungeons Pokemon that are strong foes. They're really tough, but they drop rare, but they drop rare treasures and defeat them. And spot them from the, the hazard symbol above their heads. Alright, let's do it. Let's do this. Let's do this and see what happens. Of course, having an in-boss is definitely important. That, that's what just has to happen. It'd be weird if it wasn't. Okay, let's see what they got here. Fobold orb, no. Orenberry, nah. Okay. Thank you, Minky. Dragon Cobalt. Uh, aloha, how are you? Um, welcome to my stream. Doing well, how are you? Very good to hear, Dragon Cobalt. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> 
Um, how would you prefer to be addressed? Uh, I'd like to know what to officially call you. Uh, Dragon, Dragon, Cobalt, uh, what would you, uh, prefer I call you? Very good. Alright then. Uh, may I ask how you found me? Uh, through, uh, one of, my, one of the, uh, furry sites, through Twitch itself. How'd you find me today? Welcome back, Meiji. <laughs> oh, RT! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> okay, that name I do recognize. Well, hello there! I'm glad to have you. Yeah, I've only recently started streaming. Because uh, I only just recently got a good, good enough net to be able to start doing it. And because I'm now on anti-anxiety medications, I just, maybe a week ago, maybe a little more than a week ago, started doing it. Because, uh, yeah, I hadn't actually, prior to that, done any streaming in almost 10 years. So, now that we have the proper internet to be able to do it, I decided I wanted to, uh, I wanted to do so. So, just things working out better for me, and, yeah. Been having a lot of fun doing this lately. Yeah, it's nice, nice to see ya. What did, it, what did uh, the dog get into, if I may ask? Energy ball 
ATM. Nice. Yes. Nope, I didn't mean to hit no there. Whatever, that's fine. Morning. Good morning, Charlie. Let's keep up our rescue work today. Charlie Innocent Part 1. Charlie met with the Ninetales on Mount Freeze. Ninetales testified that Charlie was not the human that appeared in the legend. As a result, Gengar's claims were found to be malicious lies. He clearly just made Gengar's quote. G -g 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 <laughs> Funny. Oh, top two items. One, gravel rock. Two, Orenberry. The nationwide survey of and rescue teams the most popular item group to gravel rock. According to Sulu of Team Fakers, it lets you attack from far away. It's invaluable. The next most popular item was the Orenberry. Okay. And quest from Oren uh, there. Okay, fine. Alright, let's uh, keep going. Let's do some more. Alrighty. Just a second, guys. Alrighty. Yeah. <laughs> 
true. That is true, yes. They will help me level up easier. Okay, there's the top, so let's keep going. Very good. Yes. Nope, still not quitting yet. As long as there are more quests, I'll keep going. Yes.
Yay, leveled up. Weedle is to my right. You really are starting a rock collection. Picking up a lot of rocks in this area. Quite a bit. Uh, quite a bit of Pokemon was picked up here. Okay, yep, we're done. Yay! Rainbow gummy, nice. And a DX gummy, very good. Seems that way, doesn't it? Time for another dream. Time for another dream. Mm -hmm. This dream again. It's been a while. Mm, your Gardevoir. Yes. Gardevoir, there's so much I want to ask you. Why do you appear in my dreams? As an agent of spirits, I must watch over you. That's my rule now. Spirits? Yes. I fell into the curse of my ideals in the place of a tree. I can be present without a physical form like this. Trainer? You mean the human that was in the wooden about nine tails? Awful that your trainer would abandon you and run away. Yes. My trainer was a terrible person. Trainer? Why not? Well, I wonder myself. I don't quite understand. I'm trying to do some terrible things, but I can't bring myself to feel hatred. My trainer had some quirks, but there were good qualities too. And when it happened, I was desperate. When it happened? You mean Nine Tail Curse? 
protected my trainer from nine tails cursed my entire being. The trainer is facing danger. It's our duty to protect the trainer with our lives. We guarded for her that way. I kept my trainer safe. That alone was enough to make me happy. Protect the trainer from the risk of your own life. It's amazing what guarded for did. Oh, I must mention, I don't mind the form I've taken. Yes. All things are role, they all serve a purpose. Just as I have my own role to play, you too have a role to fill. You have come here to perform a certain role? Oh, for that role, for that role you became a Pokemon. What? What are you saying? What? Earthquake! No, wait. I need to know more. Next morning, hmm. there was an earthquake, wasn't there? I think I had that dream again. I think I spoke with Gardevoir. She said something important. That's it. She did say something. You have come here to perform a certain role, and for that role, you became Pokemon. Gardevoir knows. She knows why I became a Pokemon. She also said something about a roll. What does she mean by that? Good morning, Charlie. Uh, what's up? Something wrong? Oh, right. That earthquake earlier. You're worried the same way I am. I should have known, Charlie. Alexander's team hasn't come back yet. And I say Groudon is wickedly strong, so yeah, it's a bit worrying. Then again, Alexander's bunch is tough too. They should be okay. Well, we did leave Groudon up to Alexander, so we can't do much of anything but wait for them to come back. We've got to do what we can do. So let's give it our best for the rescue team. Uh... Um... Um, I'm why not, and this is... Wobbuffet. Well, Notice an important board outside Pilker's office. Wobbuffet. Well, please look at it for me. Please, please. Ah. Buffet. Please help me. I have to go now. Wobbuffet. Well, What was that? What just happened? A little Pokemon. What was that? What the boy called? Why not? He wanted us to check the bulletin board in the post office. Maybe it was a problem or something. And he put up a rescue dot notice on the bulletin board. So the only way to find out, let's go to the Pelper post office and check out the bulletin board. Alrighty. Boop. Punish Bad Mankey in Uproar Forest. There was a job post on the bulletin board that said Punish Bad Mankey. Did you two put up that job? Yep, yep. About fat. Bad Mankey King is going wild in our forest. Everyone's upset. Baba fat. We don't know why they rampage around. They're always getting angry and attack anyone they see. What a fat? Hmm, that is a problem. Charlie, we should go. Thank you. We're counting on you. What a fat? Place for the Mankey Gang is wreaking havoc on others. Uproar Forest is now open for exploration. Alrighty. Um, let's see. I'm gonna 
grab that. but all crazy. He does that. Okie dokie. So three new camps. Alright, now let's go. Uproar Forest is now open for exploration. That'd be funny. Emperor Zerg in this game, that'd be funny. That would indeed be quite hilarious. but it's worth it. Yeah. <laughs> 
There we go. Huh, what is it, you? We don't like to brag or nothing, but we get furious real easy, you know that? It really irritates us when we see some dim-witted face. Hey, hey, look at that stupid face. It's ticking me off. I'm seeing red. Eh, get him, it. it's frenzy time. Aha. Uh -huh. Thank <laughs> you. 
Sheesh. Ugh, oh, you got us. Tyler completed the job at Upper Forest. No place for Avon to stay, but we got money. We got the 336 for fun adventure. Hooray. Just like we promised, we punished the gang of Mankey. I'm hoping we'll smarten up and settle down. Everyone, thank you for everything, really. Lava Fat. Yes, we're filled with gratitude. This is our thanks. Charlie Steam received peeled chestnuts as a reward. Hmm? This peeled chestnut? Yes, it's a peeled chestnut. You see, we don't have any money. Lava Fat. So we can only give you a chestnut as a reward. Are you unhappy? Uh, no, no. We're okay with this. Peeled chestnuts are delicious. I like them. Haha, <laughs> but I wish we could get some money. Hey, you. Oh no, the Mikey gang. Lava Fat? Did those goons. Did they follow us here for revenge? That's right, you. You got lucky. You don't mess with us. We're not gonna lose this time. We'll pulverize you. We're gonna crush them. Whoa, look at that. A ch chestnut? It is, it's a peeled chestnut. A what? Whisper, whisper. Mutter, mutter. What's going on? They look like they're having a discussion. Lava fat. What's this all about? Uh, listen. You got something we want. That peeled chestnut you have. Can we have it? We, uh... We love peeled chestnuts. We love it so much we can't think of life without chestnuts. Why don't you just go get the chestnuts on your own? You know how the chestnuts have a specky shell? Trying to peel that specky shell, it hurts. We end up losing our tempers. That's why we're asking, give us that peeled chestnut. We'll do anything. Hmm, what do you think, Charlie? Should we give him our peeled chestnuts to the Mankey Gang? Yeah, sure. I know. Hey, Mankey Gang, how are you guys with physical labor? Physical labor? You mean muscle work? You have, we have muscles. We don't like work. Let's throw that peeled chestnut. Okay, this is what we'll want to do. We're aiming to rebuild our rescue team base, so to make it more impressive than this. Rescue team base? You got it. Our rescue team base. If you help us build our rescue team base, we'll give you this peeled chestnut. What do you say? Whisper, whisper. Mutter, mutter. Okay, we'll help. Really? You'll help us? Yeah, leave it to us. We'll carry the materials and get the place built. Double quick. In return, hand over that peeled chestnut. Me too. I'll help too. I'll split silk for gluing things together. I'll help too. Wop the fat. I felt bad because we only had a peeled chestnut for your reward. Wop the fat. Maisie, you silly creature. Thanks, everyone. Okay, let's get a move on. Okay. Okay. And so, construction work began on the rescue team base of Charlie Steam Horizon. Several days later. Whew. Space is coming along quickly. Wow, I've had. You know everyone for this. Wow, I've had. There's still lots to do. We can't slow down now. Wow, I've had. There's still a little more to go. Don't give up now, Mankey. Huh? Look over there. What's up with you guys? You need to keep working. Don't wanna. What? This work's too boring. How do you expect us to keep going? Yeah, that's right. I don't want to do this anymore. You might change your mind if you get us more peeled chestnuts. What is it with these guys? You can be bothered. We need peeled chestnuts to motivate us. 
problem, Charlie? Looks like the mining won't work unless I get them a peel chestnut. Yeah, I'll find more peeled chestnuts and give them to the Mankey gang. The next morning... Good morning, Charlie. Let's go to the Mankey gang's morale with the peeled chestnut. Find chestnuts in F4 Forest. Makes me wish I hadn't eaten them all. Oh well. Pokemon News Extras 2. Charlie Innocent Part 2. Quote from the Charizard on the scene. That's what I thought right from the start. Ha ha ha. Quote from Ty Ty Tyranitar on the scene. That muckwrecking Gengar, he's not getting away with this. He'd better be ready for it. Switching leaders. Switch leaders and get through to a tight situation. Depending on the adventure, you can switch leaders on the spot. Press press to switch between leaders. After switching leaders, you get through a tough situation. You can also switch to a member who's separated. And things from Thunder Wave Cave. Although, actually, I don't think I can use that one, can I? Uh, Chesto Berry. I don't think I have a Chesto Berry, do I? Let me see.
Now we're good. Okay, so the last thing I'm gonna do, go over to, uh, really top over here. Let's make some more camps. Just them out, and start going in order. Because reasons. The more camps you can get, the more Pokemon you can get. sleeping actually at the moment. He's on my floor passed out at the moment. Probably. And one more Echo Cave. Yep. Okay. Alrighty. Now. Just for the sake of checking things out real quick. Uh, let's see. What else do I have? Three for, two, three for Sinister Woods, the Thunder Wave K, and the Thunder. Okay. Hmm. Uproar Forest, right. Let's see, are there any in Uproar Forest? Nope. Three in the Grand Canyon, though. I'm gonna or Great Canyon, though. I'm gonna take those for later. All right, so back to Uproar Forest we go. Could have used the shortcut, but what? Yeah. All right. Moving on. So back to Uproar Forest. That's why. We don't want that. That'd be bad. <laughs> uh, yeah, I should have been paying attention to that. Okay, let's do, it. Let's do him. That'll work. That'll work. Yeah. Okay. Up for forest. Vaccine. Depart. Here we go. That's better. So, we're looking for chestnuts, and this time, don't eat them. <laughs>
Well, I know that now. It's just been so long since the last time I actually played this game that I actually forgot about that. I haven't played this in a very long time. I mean, prior to doing this let's play. That hiding down there is a chestnut. One or several moves have been sealed. The Pokemon can't use sealed moves. The status wears off when the Pokemon moves to next floor. So I don't want to avoid the new chestnuts. Maybe. Nerves are nearby, the lower the damage when the Pokemon is hit by wide ranging moves, such as magnitude. magnitude. Rare qualities affect the whole team.
didn't get any chestnuts, darn it. No chestnuts, though. So I've got to do it again. Darn it. Seven wonders of the Pokemon. One, Mysterious Feet of Diglett. Two, what's inside the fortress of shell? Three, Intelligence of the Graphic Tale. Four, our box variety of patterns. The way to mission to find a list of Pokemon mysteries. Important moving tips. Mother diagonally is avoided being attacked by, by foes. While keeping R pressed, use the left stick to move diagonally. Change direction. It's also very important to change directions without moving while holding Y, press the left stick. Change directions. Check hints to see how you can do this maneuver. So, um, let's go back to the shop for a moment. That would be useful. Or in there, that would be helpful. No. Okay, let's see here. How about, do I have any more orange berries in storage? Probably not. Alright, let's go. Let's try this again. Let's try again. All we can do. I got eradicate. Um, I just uh, let it go for you later. <clears throat> mm, nah, I'm gonna let it go for you.
There's a chestnut. We hit one. So we found at least one this time. Yeah, there certainly are. There's quite a few strong monkeys in here, it seems. Okay, well, at least we got one, so we can get the monkeys to keep moving for us. So that's good. Field chestnut. Find chestnuts in our for our forest. <clears throat> new types of floor tiles. There have been numerous reports of new floor tiles other than wonder tiles, one of which is a training switch. If you step on it, apparently it adjusts your speed, up, speeds up your move growth. Other ones are sparkling floor. Rumor has something good buried underneath, so if you see one, be sure to step on it. The ultimate dungeon challenge is you need to do your best. Somewhere in the world, there's supposedly an incredibly tough dungeon. One must enter alone, one must enter alone at level 5 without any items. No one's ever completed the challenge. It's considered to be the test of not only power, but intelligence and wits. Interesting. Alright, now let's go to the main. Bring us a peeled chestnut? Oh, a chestnut! We want a peeled chestnut! Come on, give it to us. We'll work hard for it. Okay, here you go. Charlie peeled off his spiny shell and handed the peeled chestnut over. Yes, a peeled chestnut! Alright, layabouts. Get together. Chop chop! Why don't you quit lounge around yourself? Get moving. We'll get hustling and renovating your rescue team base. Carry the materials and get the place built double quick. Just you wait. <clears throat> and so, supplied with another peeled chestnut, I can get motivated. I'm trying to work on the rescue team's uh, renovation. As a result, rescue team base completion was a little closer. Huh? Did you bring some peeled chestnut? But you don't have any. We can't work. If you want us to renovate your base, bring us a peeled chestnut. A peeled one. See the chestnut sun disappear in a far forest, you won't come out of the shell. Oh no. Now it has a trim in your face on it. Anything in here change? Eh, okay. The stream was doing so well, too. Darn it. 
I was cr I had my fingers crossed that we we're actually gonna make it through the rest of the stream without it disconnecting. Guess we're not so lucky. Anyway, hello everybody. Yep, the stream had disconnected again. Alright, here we go. We were doing really well. I thought for sure we'd get through the stream without disconnecting, but whatever. At least I found a uh, proper thing that allows me to connect the uh, videos together, so I can just splice it together. It's not too, ter too terrible. Not a big problem. I learned how to do that properly, so that can't be an issue. As I said before, as I told you, David, a VLC doesn't stop me from viewing it, it just stops me from viewing spl uh, spliced videos properly. So I could still put it together anyway, it just wouldn't have uh, been able to properly view it on VLC. On Windows Media Player, it seems to work just fine, so I'm not worried about it. So it's fine either way. I think that's because after I've after I've uh, made the video is once I've made the video whole, it's fine. It's just the spliced videos won't play. Once I've made them all as one video, they're no longer a spliced video. That's why. Because what I'm downloading is one video. It's just the splice videos don't play properly. Because I've checked that myself. Yeah. <clears throat> Wait, there's still, there's still another blue here. I want to check that out first. Because that could be a chestnut. Nope, it's just money. That's still good, though. Still need mo uh, money's is still good, so not a bad thing. Yeah, what I end up putting on YouTube when the video spliced together becomes one video. <coughs> Excuse me. <sighs> so that's why you can download it and play it properly. Because at that point, it's a single video anyway. 
さ。Alright, Meiji, do you want taunt? And if so, what do you want me to replace? Personally, I'm not a fan of taunt, but I want to check and make sure. Yeah, okay. Just gonna keep going then. So I'm not a fan of taunt, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip it. Ah. Oh, there you are. Yeah, I never use it either, so that's fine. Through here, and at least we got the chestnut, so we're fine. We are fine.
It moves to varying ranges. It moves to the effect in the entire room with a range of two tiles in the corridor. It moves like crowd can be used effectively in the corridor. But if the visibility is limited to just one tile, the effects will also be limited. Among rescue teams, there is a growing demand for equipment that is not only practical but also professionally appealing. Pink Pet Scarf is especially popular. Even the kick one shop has triple planet QB in a sock. If you're lucky enough to spot one, make a beeline for it. That's not certainly did. There you go. Thank you, I guess. And so, this part of the chestnut, they return to work and rescued uh, continue to work on the rescue team's renovation. Rescue basic team renovation. Rescue team's eighth completion moved a little closer. One more time, I guess. Let's do it one more time. to there, I want to see what that other, other item is.
guys are silly. But I love you for it. Makes doing this even more entertaining to me. I'm entertaining you by gaming, you're entertaining the silly cat. No chestnut in this area for in this run this time unfortunately. Which means we're gonna have to do it again. Nicely done, Meiji. Thank you for the level up. Huh. Fire Fang. We'll do one more run of the dungeon, and then we're gonna call it a day, I think. So, let's try it one more time. Seen licking his paws that is so complete honey. Or well, maybe sticky sticky shaking paws of the Ursa. I can't help but feel a twinge of envy. With a simple act of courage, the Azero became a hero despite being a small size. Azero became came across Slowpoke, who had fallen into a pond. A hero's tail thrown out into the struggling Slowpoke, began to show drowning. Slowpoke claimed to have been entirely forgotten having the ability to swim capably. Okay.
and viruses. This could end up, end up badly. Um, they came from the wonder mails, that, wonder mails I got, David, so there's literally nothing I can do. It's just no more. There just aren't any more. That's it. Actually, I think I'm gonna go ahead and stop here, I think. Change my mind, we're gonna go ahead and just end it here, I believe. So, I'm gonna go ahead and save it, and we're gonna call it a day, I believe. Save it, and uh, I appreciate everyone that came in to watch me today. Thank you all very much. I was glad to have you. It was good to talk with you, and I hope you all had a fun time. But yeah, that's going to be an episode of today. Hope you all had fun. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to leave this video a like. Comment if there's something specific you enjoyed. If you haven't done so already and feel to doing so, feel free to subscribe. It'd really help my channel out. For now though, this is Bobby Thornbody. Aloha, and I will see you all next time.